Professor Van der Aar, where and when did you discover, did you realize your passion for process mining? How I got into science is a bit of a longer story. I've been working on many other things than process mining, but perhaps it's interesting to tell uh, that I had to go into the army after I finished my studies. And because I wanted to avoid getting into the army, I started working at the university. And then after doing four years of research, I loved it so much that I got hooked onto uh, doing research. Then I first worked on uh, PetriNet modeling, workflow management technologies. And then in the late 90s, I was a bit unsatisfied with the way that we did research. I think we often looked at models, not being sure what the relationship was between these models and reality. And then I came to the idea of combining machine learning, data mining, and process modeling. And I think this uh, really gave uh, a lot of new ideas because now we are learning processes based on real data and that makes it very exciting and very real and very useful. Any suggestion to young people who want to study this new discipline? I think it's very important for people to see that we are at the beginning of a new, a new era. That's the era where uh, things will be driven by data. I think in science there will be a shift from purely model-based research to research where we uh, actually are uh, using data. So I think for, for young people it's very important to see this. We are now at a stage which is comparable to computer science in the 80s. We are at a stage where uh, yeah, things are booming, possibilities are endless. In fact, if I think about it, I think in 10 years it could be that there are more data scientists than computer scientists that we educate. And this makes it very, very important for people to invest in data science skills. You spend one month here in FBK. What is your opinion on this research center? Well, it's great to be here uh, at FBK. I think it's an institute at a great location. I think uh, FBK is very strong in ICT. There are many groups working on different uh, topics. Uh, what I think is also very interesting is the collaboration with industry. I think in ICT research, this is very important. And I think that uh, the groups uh, are working with many different organizations here, which makes it very interesting.